An Enterprise Master Patient Index, or MPI, is a database that holds patient identifiers and demographic data for every medical record across a healthcare organization. The MPI record includes both identifiers and demographic data for the patient, but does not include clinical data. All clinical data is kept in clinical systems, such as an electronic medical record, or EMR. The information in these systems are called medical records, or clinical data records. These medical records contain demographics, identifiers, and clinical data, and are the source of demographic and identifier data for the MPI records. The MPI links the identifiers for an individual based on an examination of the demographic data from those records. While each data source could have its own master patient index, an Enterprise Master Patient Index, or EMPI, connects all facilities in a network. In many cases, a master patient index and an enterprise master patient index can be used interchangeably. In a network of healthcare organizations, one patient could have multiple medical records throughout the enterprise. Let's take Elizabeth Ames' MPI record as an example. Notice here that there are two MPI records that have her name, one with demographics from General Hospital and one with demographics from North Hospital. Each facility's medical record has collected the same demographics, but each also has a unique medical record number, or MRN, for that facility. When demographic information is the same, it is easy to see that these MPI records correspond to the same individual and should share one enterprise ID. These MPI records will be linked as belonging to the same individual in the Master Patient Index. Notice here that the MPI record for Elizabeth Ames will point to the MRN at each hospital. Sometimes, the demographic data in two medical records may differ slightly, and it is the task of the MPI to compare the demographics and decide if the medical records are for one individual, or if, for example, Betsy and Elizabeth might be twins. Let's take a look at some other examples that make matching difficult. Nicknames typos, summer or winter home addresses, maiden names, missing information, unknown trauma patients, and unnamed infants. These are just some examples, but there are a lot of data comparison issues that make matching difficult. An enterprise master patient index incorporates algorithms and human review to determine if two records should be linked and consequently share the same unique enterprise identifier. HealthShare Patient Index as an MPI has three basic functions. One, comparing and linking demographic data from two healthcare organizations. Two, returning and ranking results in response to a patient search. Three, identifying duplicates from the same source for further action. Every time a new MRN is received, HealthShare Patient Index must determine whether it represents a new patient or an existing patient. If Patient Index determines the data identifies a new patient, it will create a new enterprise ID. If the demographics associated with the MRN match those of an existing patient, it will assign the MRN to an existing enterprise ID. HealthShare Patient Index automatically links records where it can, but requires manual intervention and review when ambiguity exists. You will learn more about how these ambiguous matches are handled later in this course.